I'm so happy. And uh, I honor the grace upon your life. Thank you so much together with Papa. I never knew I can know you this much, but I thank God. Thank you so much. God bless you and keep you for me. <laughs> Praise God, church. Uh, my name is Teflin. Um, I'm a mother, a single mom of two, Treven, and this is Trina. <laughs> I came here one month ago. It was on second, on Sunday. And uh, when I came, Mama, I was broken. I was physically broken, spiritually broken, and shattered. I was not only facing rejection, but I was also humiliated. I was going through so much in life. Even coming, I was telling some, you know, I have not been going to church <laughs> for the past one year. And I'm telling him, I'm thinking maybe on that Sunday I'll be shifting, so I might not come. And one thing, one word he told me was that you've not been going to church, so why would shifting be a reason for you not to come on Sunday? And then I just told him I'll think about it. When I came that day, I was late. And I also had to fight my own battles for coming because <laughs> the devil is always there. He always fixed himself. When he knows you are going to get a, a door, he will always come. So that day I also fought my own battle. And when I came, the someone was uh, walking through labor to favor. And that word really touched me. And when I was just entering the door, Mama was saying that, uh, you know, sometimes when you are in the labor, you will find that those who have been your friends are the ones who will turn against you. you will, the door will be closed on you that day, and there was, there was also even a, a play that <laughs> someone was being closed the door on, and that was me. I, had, I was living in a house, I couldn't pay for my own rent, <laughs> and I had many areas. A house that you're paying 3,500, but, uh, 3, but you have arrears of 16,000, that is a lot. And uh, on that... So on that Sunday when I came, that was the battle I was going through. Then on Monday... Uh, just before we, 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 we moved from here, you know, we reached at the gate, and one thing my son told me was, Mom, we should be coming to this church. <laughs> that was how it started. And I was asking him why, and then she was like, he was like, you know, Mom, we should just come. I see that pastor really loves you. And how did she even know what is going through in your life? <laughs> And I'm like, maybe when you grow up, you will understand. <laughs> but for now, just know she knows. So when we, when we went home on Monday, my door was locked. And that time, on Sunday when we went home, it started, the grace started working. I was looking for a new place because I just said this place now because if it is at reach a point where they are closing the door for me, maybe I should move to another place, uh, things might change and things really did change. So I was looking for a house and then I found there were two houses. There was one for the high on and the other one for a block house. So when I was asking my son, what do we do? <laughs> and then he's, he's only eight years. He said that we should go for a block house. Uh, because the, the pastor said that our life will not be the same, so we should go for the blockhouse. <laughs> so uh, there's a friend of mine that uh, I used uh, with that uh, we normally talk with her. They are on a mission here in Kenya, but they're from UK. So I, I talked with her. I told her, like, she has been like her mother to me always <laughs> then uh, when i was talking to her about that she just told me just go with the faith 
to the bl for the blockhouse. Don't look the, the, the amount that you'll be paying. And uh, it came through that I moved from a house of 3,500 to her double house of 5,000. Amen. 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 And because I was crying, that, and that day they closed the door on me on Monday, I was telling God, I know you have already done it, but please, I am praying that next time I will not want to see this scene where um, the door is closed on me with my children outside at night. Don't allow it to happen again. And because of that, I, I, right now, I am able to pay the rent for two months ahead. Amen, amen, amen. I think Mama said that, uh, you know, it is my new season. And uh, finance, financially, I will be okay. I'll be stable. Mm. Money has been coming. Amen, amen, amen. Because I lost myself. And because of the pain and rejection, I even ran away from God. I was not doing what I'm, not, I'm supposed to do. I couldn't even pay tithe. I was like, God, everything is mine now because it is me for my survival. <laughs> so even I, when I was selling maize, I could not create time to go even for any service because I know if I go to any service, maybe I'll be a, a lack food. And because the last month was the month of divine rest, God really did give me rest. Amen. 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 Now I can find time to come to church during weekdays. Mm. On, and on Wednesday, I've really seen God. Mm. After every service, something will come that shows me this is God. Amen. Amen. Every time, every Amen. deliverance has been coming, things have been coming, and the way I go through them, I see God. Mm. Yes, so I really thank God because I've seen what he's doing, Mama. Amen. And if I was not planning to testify today, but something that has been happening to me, that it's either I wake up on Sunday while coming, there's a song I'll wake up singing. And then when I just reach the door, I find you singing the same song. Mm. <laughs> I could not pray. I'd lost myself. But Mama, nowadays, sometimes it's like you are my alarm. Sometimes I just see your hand at 12 a.m. wake up and pray. Mm. <laughs> and uh, and uh, I'm really thanking God for that grace. Even yesterday, there's something that happened. And it really defined all the someone that you have me today. I didn't know. I had not been able to go to cell. But yesterday, I woke up. And uh, God really... I met someone on the road, um, a, a woman. And what, what happened, even me, I didn't understand. But today what you were saying about divine placement, there's something that that woman said for me. He said that, thank God, thank you so much, and God bless you. I pray that one day you'll be a great person. Mm. And what you say today is what has moved me to testify that don't just see me coming. You might not see maybe what Mama said is not working. It is working in a big way. Amen. <laughs> Thank Amen. you so much. God bless you. Continue with the love. And Mama, I am really praying to God that he continue uplifting you higher and higher Amen. for his glory. Amen. Amen. Be blessed. Amen. Amen. Put your hands together for Christ.